everybody. We're coming to you this morning from Cyprus and today we're with Tickmill CMO and we're going to be talking about marketing within Tickmill. Good morning, Marilena. How are you? Good morning, Sophie. I'm really good. Thank you. Uh, thank you for uh, this uh, amazing opportunity to talk about Tickmill and marketing. It's my pleasure. Um, so, Marilena, what I wanted to start with is asking about the main role of the marketing department. Uh, the main role of marketing is helping the company expand and win market share in our target countries, uh, but also enhance and uh, sustain the company's good reputation. Our marketing department is also responsible for communicating Tickmill's unique advantages mm -hmm. to the correct audience in an effective manner. Wonderful. Okay. So, what's the biggest challenge regarding Google and online advertising restrictions for uh, that have emerged over the past few months? Well, the biggest challenge is the advertising restriction regarding financial products uh, in countries where we don't have a uh, license from the relevant financial authorities. For example, Asia is a region where trading is very popular and it's an easy market to penetrate. Uh, but however, we cannot do that anymore because we don't have a license on the specific country. So how did you overcome this? We have started operating with other advertising platforms and uh, we have increased our direct online media buys uh, for countries where we couldn't utilize Google anymore. We have also allocated some budgets to content marketing. Nice. Um, so, Tickmill is a company with a global presence. Uh, does marketing follow a strategy for each country and region? Yes, so we can have a global marketing strategy with a localized approach. Our overall aim is to continue building Tickmill's image as a transparent and reliable broker, uh, which was built by traders for traders. However, in order to be able to reach countries around the world, we need uh, to investigate and figure out each country's trading habits. For example, what is the most important thing that they need from a broker, or what instruments do they trade more often? Is it a country with experienced and sophisticated traders or a country that just discovered trading uh, and the currently a vulnerable landscape? Do they use specific trading strategy? There is a lot of information that still needs to be explored to be able to achieve that bespoke and localized service. Wow, okay. Um, but what differentiates Tickmore from other brokers? Well, uh, even though we're an online trading firm, which could give the impression that we're relatively impressional, Tickmill differentiates itself by adopting a more human approach. We have one-to-one -one communication to, with any client that needs our assistance, and we like to meet our clients and partners personally. Uh, we are also well known for our supreme trading conditions, like our extremely low spreads uh, and com commission combined with our ultra fat execution. Nice. All designed to make our trading environment ideal for every type of trader. Last but definitely not least, uh, our numerous licenses give us a strong l regulatory standing point as a group. Wow. Okay. Now let's go down into the nitty gritty. What work related issues keep you up at night? There is a number of things that can keep me up at night, but uh, if I have to choose one, it will be the launch of a big project, mm -hmm. uh, which despite all the testing before we launch, could still have issues when we go live. Mm -hmm. um, but what makes you excited to come to work in that case? Uh, it's the fact that I really believe in Tickmill and its potential, as well as my incredible team. Uh, no matter how smart and capable you are, you cannot as achieve as much alone as you can with a team. Tickmill's marketing team is made up by very talented and devoted individuals who have the privilege to call my colleagues. Um, so what would you say is the secret of a successful marketing strategy? In uh, this job, I always have a motto, which is uh, never speculate always test and optimize. Uh, you can create a strategy that in theory has potential to work. However, during implementation of this strategy, something may not go as planned. So you need to be prepared to change things and you can only achieve that by optimizing and changing what doesn't seem to work for you. 
Um, so what type of advertisement work better for financial companies like Ticknell? Well, um, as an online broker, we are focusing more on online advertising where we can easily reach our audience. But I believe that a healthy marketing strategy needs a combination of all types of advertising in order to enhance brand awareness and become established. Therefore, we're not only participating, but also organizing various offline events to give us the opportunity to meet our clients and partners. We are also using uh, popular publications, uh, giving a lot of emphasis to CSR as well. Nice. And CSR's corporate social responsibility, yeah? Yes, and it's one of my favorite part of the job. Lovely. Um, now, what role does technology play in marketing? Uh, nowadays, technology plays a huge role in marketing. We try to create marketing automation by utilizing artificial intelligence to target customers uh, better, reach more people, uh, and increase retention. By using automation technology, we are also increasing efficiency and improving time management, but also enhancing uh, user experience through personalization. With all the new technologies, we can now analyze data demographically, access social information and behavioral data to predict lead scoring. By achieving this, we can generate uh, more quality leads and deliver target information to the right people. Nice. Um, so what are Tickmill's future plans with regards to marketing? What should we keep an eye out for? Uh, as the financial uh, scene is changing really fast, uh, I cannot actually answer the question precisely. I can only tell you that our future plans will focus on making our customer journey and experience as easy and efficient as possible. Uh, we will also continue building strong brand awareness across the globe so people around the world know about Tickmill uh, and the benefit we as a company can offer. Well, I think that's all we've got time for today. Um, so thank you, Marilena, for giving up some of your time to come and talk to us. We really appreciate it. Thank you too, Sophie. Nice to see you guys.